Hello friends, in this tutorial we are going to see what is pull request in GitHub. On GitHub, owner can share his code with others. Now other person can look at the code and he can make changes to fix a bug or add an enhancement and then send a request to the owner to pull or merge his code changes into owner's repository. This request is called a pull request. Let's understand this by using this picture. These four people own this GitHub repo. Let's say this is the repository for Node.js, which is an open source project. This guy here, his name is Tom. And let's say Tom looks at Node.js code base and then he realizes that he needs to fix uh, some bug or make some enha enhancement. Now, since this is an open source project, he can copy the project into his local GitHub private repository, then pull the project on his local computer, make code changes. So this blue color indicates the code change that he made, and then he can push that into his own private GitHub repository. After that, he can create a pull request uh, asking owners to pull his code changes into owner's repository. When this request is sent, owners can see the difference, which is this blue color line, code change, and they can either comment or they can just accept the request directly. So pull request allows you to uh, start a conversation around that code change between the owners and between the code contributor so this promotes a collaboration and pull request is one of the reasons why github has become very popular okay now let's look at the demonstration so let's say we have these two users brad and angelina uh, who not only collaborate as a wife and husband or actors but they want to do a collaboration when it comes to programming as well. So this guy has uh, this code repository called Hungry and he has all this code. Now if you look at the URL, that is Brad27. So this is owned by Brad. Okay. Now Angelina looks at this code base and she wants to, let's say, make some changes here. So she will then go and so the person on the right here is Angelina. So she will open uh, this repository here. So as you can see here, the signed in user is Angelina, but she has opened the repository from Brad and she can click on this fork button to copy Brad's code into her own private repo okay so now she has code base copied and now you can see there is the link says angelina okay so typically she will uh, pull the if the code changes are huge she will pull this code base into her local computer and make code changes run the code and do some tests verify it and once things look okay she will push it here to her own private repository but since this is a tutorial i'm going to make code change directly on this uh, web website so if you don't know uh, github allows you to edit code directly on their website so i will just click on edit file and make a code change here and i will say and hungry equal to y so she wants to add y as a valid input okay uh, so let me make this bigger so that you can see what code change i made so she just added this line okay and then she can uh, commit her changes you can say okay added y as a valid answer and commit changes so once you do that and if you uh, go to your commits you can see the difference here by clicking here so it says you added this thing here okay now it is the time to create a pull request 
so angelina is ready with her core changes now she wants to merge these core changes here into brad's repository so for that uh, she will uh, click on pull request here okay and then let's see so here there is a button new pull request so click on new pull request so here it will tell you from where you are merging to which repository so your base repository is brad 27 so this says that from angelina hungry uh, code repository master branch i want to merge into brad's repository okay and it allows you to see the difference so if i am angelina angelina can see that i am asking to add this code change okay so i'll click on create pull request here you can add some meaningful comment here and then just say create pull request so at this point the code from here it's not merged here okay so now angelina is kind of waiting for brad to review his, her code okay so if i am brad i will uh, in this area if if I just refresh my web page, I will see this little notification, okay? And this notification is telling me that, okay, let me maximize the screen. So this notification is now telling me that uh, someone has sent me a pull request. So I will click here. And uh, if I want to see the actual code, code changes, I can, uh, go here in files change and I can see the code changes now I'm Brad let's say and I I like this code change but then one thing is I want to add capital Y as an input so I will put a comment saying that a uh, good change I like it can you also add capital Y uh, so then you will put your comment here and once you put your comment now let's go back to Angelina because the ball is in Angelina's code now okay and once she opens this pull request she will see a comment from Brad 27 saying that good change I like it can you also add why okay so now what Angelina will do is she kind of agrees with brad so she will go ahead and add y as well so uh let's see so here i'm in this pull request okay uh, just a second okay sorry so i'm looking at brad's coach okay i shouldn't be so this is brad's repository okay let me go back so angelina should be looking at her repository which is hungry okay so here what she will do is she will add capital Y as a valid input. So she will say okay and hungry equal to capital Y then that also is a valid input. Added capital Y into list of valid answers. Okay she will commit her code change and let's look at the pull request okay so the pull request will be here okay so now you can see here that there is added y into list of valid answers and if you look at this files change now i have both of this available in my pull request okay so if i am brad i will also again get a notification saying that uh angelina again see there is a notification here saying that there is some update on this pull request so uh you can view the chain that was made last time or view, you can view all the changes so now this change kind of looks okay to me and i'm fine merging it into my repository so what i will do is i will go here and i will click on merge button okay eventually you will click on merge button to merge it 
so now what happened is in Brad's repository I have now these code changes so this completes the cycle and now I have Brad and Angelina both showing up as uh, the code contributor okay so that was just a nice uh, quick demo of pull request they are extremely popular in open source world where there is a open source project and multiple people contribute to it okay and this whole model of pull request and sharing code is number one reason why github is so popular